Hey everyone, welcome back to Apex Predator Gaming. This is Apex, and I hope everyone is having an absolutely awesome day. Today, we are doing some more building on ARK Survival Evolved Mobile Edition. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to build a barn-style stable. This stable is a great early game build to store some small to medium creatures while having a really fun look. Also, this is another PvE build. So if you want to know how it's done, stick around, and I'm going to show you. Alright, let's get started. So to start as usual, we will place our foundation and as you can see I have already placed mine here and I have gotten it lowered into the ground to the correct height that I need so that I can um, have no interruptions and place the full foundation down and not have to use any ceilings or any other tricks. And from this initial foundation we will place an additional 119 foundations in a 10 by 12 rectangle and I'm going to bring you back when those are placed. With our foundations down, now we're going to place our pillars along the side that we're going to have be our lean-to. So start with a fence foundation, and we're going to place that right here on the outside edge. The outside edge. And then we're going to follow that by placing two pillars. And then we're going to repeat that on the opposite end here. And then again we're going to repeat this, repeat this same process two more times, four foundations in from these outside pillars. With the pillars placed, now we're going to start our gates. So we're going to start by placing our gates five foundations from the pillars on each end here. It's going to be easier to do that from up on the foundation. Okay, and we're going to repeat that on this other side. Okay, and now on the lean-to side of your barn, we're going to place gates two foundations away from the edge here, and we're going to start one foundation in. And then we're going to skip two foundations and place another gate. And again, skip two more and place the third gate. Okay, and then we're going to repeat that process on the opposite side of the build. Alright, next we will place the window frames on the bottom section. So we're going to place two window frames on each side of the two gates on either end of the build. And we're going to fill those with the greenhouse windows. And 
now we can complete the outside walls. So we're gonna fill in four walls high all the way around the outside of the building, including in line with the gates that are on the lean-to side of the build. And I'm gonna bring you back when that's done. Okay, the next thing I want to do is place some ramps down to have a way up to get into all of our gates. So we can start on the end here and make our way on the side all the way to the other end. Next we will fill in the ceiling for the lower section. The easiest way to do that is to start by placing three ceilings right here. And on the end of those three ceilings, we're going to place our hatch frame. And then we're going to place our four ladders inside of that. And then we can climb up to the top. And now that we're up top, we can fill in the entire rest of the barn except for the part that is over the lean-to and then I'm going to bring you back when that's done. And now we will place the walls for the upper section. So begin by placing a sloped wall on one end. Next to that, place a normal wall with a sloped wall on top of that. And next, place two window frames and we're going to fill in those window frames with the greenhouse windows. And next we're going to place four regular walls, but we want those flipped to be facing the opposite direction. Follow that with two more window frames with greenhouse windows. And then one normal wall topped by a sloped wall. And then lastly our sloped wall. And then we're going to mirror this on the opposite side.
Next, we can fill in the ceilings for the upper section. So we'll start at one end and place two sloped ceilings. And we'll follow that by placing four ceilings across the top. and then two more slope ceilings. Okay, and we're gonna fill all of these ceilings and slope ceilings all the way across the top to the other end. Okay, now we can complete the lean-to. We're gonna start by placing two walls here on the back side of the barn. And then we're gonna top that by a sloped wall. And then two more here, topped by a sloped wall. And from these sloped walls, we're going to fill in the sloped ceilings all the way across. We can now finish the inside on the bottom, so we're going to start by placing three walls inside of the front dino gate on each side. And we're going to continue by skipping one foundation and placing three more walls. And we'll do that on both sides for the remaining four stalls. Next, we're going to finish separating the stalls by placing three walls from the end of the middle wall to the outside of each wall. Repeat that for all the stalls. And we can finish the stalls off by placing two metal railings on the top of each wall.
Next, we'll place a catwalk in each corner of the barn. And two more near the center of the barn. And then on top of each catwalk, we're going to place a lamp. And now we will get our power for the lamps. So we're going to climb up top. We're going to place an electrical intersection here in the corner and be careful to get this as straight as possible. Connect four straight cables to this intersection. Followed by one more intersection. and then five more straight cables. And then end it with another intersection. And now across the middle, we will place straight electrical cables. Followed by one more intersection. And repeat the same pattern on this side as we did on the other side. Next, we're going to place our electrical outlets on the outside of each section. And lastly, we'll place the generator and that can be connected to any of our intersections. And that's it. You can decorate and paint the barn any way you'd like. That's it everyone, there is how to build a barn style stable. I really hope you all enjoyed this build and if so, please do consider leaving a thumbs up down below. Also, do you have any build ideas for me or want to know how to build a specific structure? If so, please leave a comment down below and let me know. I will try to get a design going for it and get it added into my list of future videos. If you found this video helpful, be sure to check out some more of my other videos like this one and click to subscribe if you want to keep updated on all the new videos when they are released. You can also follow me on Twitter and join the Discord if you want to hang out in between episodes. I will be uploading new videos every Tuesday and Friday, so make sure to look out for those. Thank you all so much for watching, this has been Apex Predator Gaming, and I hope to see you next time. Apex out.